Yes. I know I look like a cafeteria lady, but it's all good. Can you school y'all on something? Okay. You know how I told you about the pasta last time. Not everybody knows how to cook. But you do. You are boiling your water. See those bubbles in it? And that white stuff around there? That's the salt and the cooking oil that I told y'all to put in your pasta so that your pasta won't stick together and you won't have it. But you guys are getting my recipes now. I normally don't do this all the time, but your girl likes sausage in her um, spaghetti. I call it bangetti. You heard me. <laughs> Let's get it. And I'm just gonna make like a pot of spaghetti. I'm supposed to have some company, so they can help me in here. But yeah, it's, since it's just me, I'm only gonna drop two of these. Don't forget the rest of it off. You heard me. We're clean this way. <laughs> on your chopping block, and whatever size sausage you want them chopped, do so. Right now, I'm trying to multitask, so I'm not gonna be able to show you guys until you guys actually see me take a bite of it. Now we're going to need ground beef, unless you're doing like a chicken spaghetti, or um, I've done a chicken spaghetti before, but not a turkey, so I don't know what you're doing with a turkey, but yeah. Ground beef, and make sure your hands are clean, okay? I got this. So yeah, I'm gonna go on ahead and brown this so that I can drain it, so that I can go on ahead and put my onions on in the skillet as well. Get her browning the meat. And make sure that if you are doing other things that you keep your fire or your eye down on low so that you can handle whatever else you need to handle without your meat burning or being overcooked, okay? Because when it gets just like hard, like you can catch a spaghetti goodbye. Boom! So of course your girl lied because I gotta show y'all how to chop up your meat especially for the people that don't know how to cook. So, you see the size slices of sausage that I like, so. Oh, and you can take that both ways. And the ingredients that you're gonna use, grounded black pepper, seasoned all mortons, garlic salt, onion powder. And we're gonna jump right over here so I can show you guys what not to do, but I had something happening and I had to step away, but yes, yeah, stir, okay? I'm your cafeteria worker, you heard me. Now, let me stop calling myself that. But yeah, um, see them lightly. If you have high cholesterol, don't be coming to me saying that I told you to season heavily. No, I know my season and where to stop. So, <sighs> your breaks on the seasoning, you heard me. Um, for people that, <laughs> y'all, please don't do y'all be like that. I had some other stuff going on, but yeah. When you're draining it, please run hot tall water. That way, the grease will not solidify and clog up your sink. But moving on to our spaghetti noodles, and we're gonna put it into the boiling water with the um, cat full and a half of vegetable oil and salt sprinkle. And I got my oh my friends. And yeah, I did that just for you, the fucker that got on my story and was like, you know, you need to grow up. <laughs> Bitch, I did that just for you. Okay, what all you're pretty much just gonna mix them together and uh, yeah. Um, I'm gonna show you the outcome and put lots of cheese in there if you're not lactose intolerant. But I am lactose, so hey, bro, toilet, get ready. Go! Okay, so I have two different types of cheeses, and what I'm gonna do is put them all in here. You see how good that looks? Like, it's awesome. So get ready to mix it, okay? You guys can also mix corn into your um, your spaghetti. It ain't what I call it, because it's my, my damn recipe, so I call it what I call it, but yeah. Um, so what you guys are gonna do is just watch me before I mix my cheese and then I'm gonna cap it and let it kind of simmer for about maybe like 30 minutes. And then I'll be about to get off and I'll be ready to indulge in a plate. So hey, get ready. So, yes, yes, your spaghetti is supposed to look like this, yes. And we're gonna just mix that. And what I'm gonna do is add some more cheese on the top, okay? Okay, you see that additional cheese? That's how you wanna, that's how you like it. Now cap that hole and got it uh, good to go. Um, I forgot where I last left off at by, so, but yeah, hold on, wait. I'm all scatterbrained because I was trying to hurry up, take a bath, come in here and take my food. Hello again to oh my friends. <laughs> nah. <laughs> oh my God. Okay, so yeah, like I said, we were gonna mix off of the items and put cheese and an extra cheese. So I'm about to flip this camera and show y'all my outside. Outlook, I'm sorry, I'm a little tipsy though. Outlook on my spaghetti, okay? Okay, 
So look, we see the sausages, the noodles, the cheese everywhere. You heard me. I'm going to top that off with a little bit of ranch and I'm going to show y'all how I eat. Since y'all going to beg for it, I'll get this here rag wetted and tear your ass up. 